guys welcome back just another quick tutorial with regards to macros in Excel what we're going to show you to do today is how you can change what this button says to make it more descriptive so this is useful if someone else is using the spreadsheet that you've used obviously the fact that your button says command but doesn't mean anything to anybody else what does it do okay so this button here just inserts a new row with a new formula okay to make this more descriptive what you need to, to, so to basically tell someone what this button is going to do if you press it is first of all press design mode select your button and press properties now you'll see there's two things here name and caption name is what the button is referenced as within the macro itself so we don't want to change this okay if we change this we have to change our code in our macro which is far too complicated for what we want to do here all we need to change is the caption okay so I've called this insert new row close that off out of my design mode okay and now you can see that my caption within there has changed my button will still work okay now to change the size of this just go into your design mode select make it a bit wider you can do other things with changing the font and things so feel free to have a play around within this properties menu okay you can change the font you can change the color of the button so if you want to make it more um, in line with what you maybe your company policy for instance if you have a color scheme you could try and do that, but it is fairly limited with regards to the colors that the buttons can be. Um, it's pretty much button colors, um, as you've seen here. So feel free to have a play around with those as well. Just don't change the name. The name, like I said, is the reference in your macro of what that button is called. Okay, hope that's helped. See you again.